Alright y'all, so, we're back here for another career sim, of course. We have the 15th overall pick, Mark Williams, so we're pretty much halfway done with the first round. Uh, still got a lot to do, but it is fine. I'm having fun making these. Majority of them anyway, there have been some that's been kind of a dud, but. Anyways, Mark Williams, 7 foot, 50 overall pick, 20 years old, center, he's on the Hornets. Let me see if center is his best position. Powerful looks a little bit better, but he can't shoot, so I'm going to leave him at center. Alright, now, y'all already know how this works. We send the career of one of the rookies from the 2022 draft, and we see how they do. That's pretty much how this goes. So, first we got to make sure he's getting minutes, which I doubt he is, yep. So, I'm going to have to remove... Oof. I'm sorry... Nick Richards, but you got to have your minutes removed. Because Mark Williams got to play. So, Mark could get 14 minutes to start. Fourteen minutes is, is good to start off. So, there we go. And now we simulate. Mark Williams, Season 1. Curse him. Here we go. Alright. Luca got MVP. Paolo got Rookie of the Year. Cole got Six Man. Giannis Depoy. Devin Most Improved. I doubt Mark Williams made a rookie team. Yeah. Like last time, I do have every team control just because it makes it easier for me if a rookie like switches teams or gets traded so I don't have to do all my settings again. Obviously, the Hornets don't make the playoffs, but let's look at Mark Williams, see what he did. Alright, let's go over here. Six points, four rebounds, an assist, a block, 53 and 77. Why is he shooting threes? Pretty good stats. Pretty good stats. I need to... Because why is he shooting any threes? Sorry, y'all. No. Like, Mark Williams is one of those rookies that I feel like his career is going to be hit or miss. Um, Like, I don't think he'll ever be a superstar. I feel like his ceiling is, like... 7th, 8th man. On a championship team, he would be like... I think he could be the 7th or 8th guy on a championship team. If it's a, a shitty team, then he could probably be a 1 through 5. Like, But... I would say he's like the 7th man. When I said 1 through 5, I meant like... One of the best players. Not position, obviously, he would be the 5. But one of the best players. But in terms of... A good team, he would probably like this, like a championship. He'd probably like the seventh guy. But enough about that. He did what he had to do. Um, decent rookie season. So, all right, here we go. We got the Heat versus the Grizzlies. We got Ja versus Tyler Hero. Grizzlies went in four. Ja's your finals MVP. All right. Gonna get the draft class. I'm not gonna do this every time. I'm just gonna do it. All right, now where is Mark? Seventh overall, he went up like one. We gotta see the minutes. The team added T.J. Warren, Kuzma, Scoot. They drafted Scoot. Okay. See, like, this hurts Nick Rich- uh, Mark- not Nick Richards. Mark Williams now. Cause, how am I about to give him these minutes? I'm gonna have to take minutes away. Caleb Martin- Cody- what- Cody doesn't really need that much minutes. So we'll give Mark- he had 15 last time. We'll give him a little bit more.
Yeah, we'll run that. Run something like that for now. Alright. Let's sim. Mark Williams, Season 2. Did he get any badges or anything? Four badges. Let me just see real quick. Arrow, Wizard, Fast Twitch, Rise Up, and Pogo. Alright. Season 2, here we go. Tatum got MVP, Scoop Rookie of the Year. Alright. He also got Sixth Man of the Year. Mitchell Depoy, Wiseman Most Improved. Hornets did not make the playoffs. Mark Williams, second season. A little bit better. Seven points, four rebounds, and assists. A block. 57 71. Okay. Sorry, I hit my mic. We gotta get past all this. Got the Celtics and the Grizzlies. Tatum versus Ja. Grizzlies win at five. Ja's your finals MVP. Grizzlies back to back. Alright, but yeah, Mark Williams, he's doing fine. I feel like he would better fit more on a team that he could start. Like, probably the, I don't know, maybe the Jazz. He would be a starting setter, probably on that team. The Spurs, definitely. Well, no, because they have Yakum. Never mind. But, it gotta be a team where he could start, I feel like. Because, he might start. He's the highest overall. Oh, no, that's Nick Richards. My bad. He's close. It's just Nick Richards is, is taking over. But Mark, great development. 77 overall in Season 3. Definitely going to be a bench player. But he should get minutes here. Yeah, 19 minutes. Alright. Let's simulate. Here we go. Alright. Jog at MVP. That guy wrecked the year. A man got six men. AD Depoy. A man got most improved. Hornets did not make the playoffs. Oh, wait, no. Yes, they did. They're right there. Have they made it in the past? I keep forgetting they're in the East. I always thought they were in the West. I don't know if they've made it in the past or not. Is there a way I could, like, check? I don't think so. Maybe they've made it. I don't know, y'all. I mean, y'all see it, so y'all could, you know, comment down below if I missed it. They are what? The 8th seed? I can't really see from the view I'm at right now. They're the 5th seed. Okay, 5th seed, Charlotte Hornets. Now that we got that out the way, let's see what Mark Williams did for his third season. 10 points, 7 rebounds, 2 blocks. Okay, an assist. 54, 17, 77. Why is he shooting threes? Oh my gosh. Like, he doesn't have to shoot any threes. Like, alright, well, let's see what the Hornets do. Round one, they got the Celtics. Oh, they lost in seven. Mark Williams. Averaged 10, 8, and 2. Okay. Alright. At least they, they brought it to 7. We got RJ Barrett. He's on the Jazz now versus Tyler Hero. Heat versus Jazz. Heat went at 7. Tyler's your finals MVP. KM MVP. A man got 6 man. Giannis Depoy. Alright. So, let's see what happened with um, Mark. Now, I can't search names, so I'm going to have to... See where he went. Alright, Mark. Mark is on the Bulls. Okay. Switch over to the Bulls. They made the playoffs. They're the three seed. They got, they do, I mean, this team has a lot of setters. Yeah. 
You still get 24 minutes. This team has a lot of centers. They got Dante. Why is that going to be doing in 26 minutes? Eh, he is old, I guess. They got this guy. They got Yuta. They got Aiden Capella. They got that guy. Mark Thomas Bryan. This team has a bunch of centers. A bunch of centers. Team's not that good, so I don't know. I don't know how to feel. We did make it to the second round, though. So let's look at the first round stats. So in that first round, Mark had 15, 5, and 1. We didn't look at his season stats, my bad. His season stats, he had 14, 5, 1, 2, 64, and 82. And then so far in the playoffs, he has 13, 5, 1, 1, 60, and 86. So really going up with the free throw. I like to see that. The field goal. All right. Here we go. Round two. They did lose. And five, but I mean, they were going against the Cavs, so what do I expect? Now, second round, he didn't really do too much. Eight, and, eight, five, and two. Overall, 12, 12, five, and one. Okay. We got Victor and the Pels versus Garland and the Cavs. Pels sweep, Victor finals MVP. All right, so he's on the Bulls now. All right, let's do a roster checkup. Do a roster checkup. All right. So, we saw something there. Sixers still got these two. Giannis still on the Bucks. We already know the Bulls team. The Cavs still got their big four. Tatum's no longer on the Celtics. AD and Marketing went to the Clippers. Grizzlies still got their team. Um, Hawks have Vucevic. Kate still got their team. Jamal Murray's now on the Hornets. Uh, Miles Bridges, RJ on the Jazz. The Kings still got their big three. Tatum went to the Knicks with Keontae, Denny, Marcus Smart, etc. Lonzo went to the Lakers with Jaded Ivy. That would be a nice one-two punch. And they got DeAndre Hunt and Jakob Poto. They're a pretty good team. Pretty good team. Um, Paulo, France on the Magic. Mavericks, Chris stops his back, but no Luka. Uh, Nets still got their big three. Jokic and Bones on the Nuggets. Pacers got Xavier Booker. Zion, Ingram, and Vic on the Pels. Pistons got Cade. Scotty and Siakam on the Raptors. Rockets still got Jalen Green. The Spurs got Collier and Vassell, Keldon, Shohan. Booker still on the Suns. Thunder still got Shea, Giddy, and Chet. These, that trio stood the, the Timberwolves, Shaded Sharp, Simons on the Blazers, Warriors got Curry, Mikey Williams, Kaminga, okay. Luka went to the Wizards. The team around him's not good. Davis hasn't really progressed. Beal has regressed. So that's the end of that. Not a lot of switches, honestly. So maybe we did the roster update a little too early, but still. All right, Mark Williams is gone. All right. Wait, was that him right there? No, that's Patrick. Okay, Mark is gone. All right. I didn't see his name, so I don't know if he signed to a team. Nope, a free agent again. Well, y'all know what we got to do. Sims to the end and uh, see what happens with Mark. Back-to-back -back free agent. I don't know. He's he's a young center, 80 overall. Why does he not have a roster spot? But let's simulate. Here we go. Tato got MVP. Giannis got Depoy. All right, let's see what happened with Mark. Go to roster. Go to all players. Go to center. He went to the Grizzlies. Okay. Let's switch over. Grizzlies. All right. Well, now they have a full starting lineup. Ja, Bane, Brooks, Triple J, Mark, 
Triple J and Marcus kind of defensively, that's a really good front court. But offensively, I don't know. Jared could shoot. 37 from the three. All right. They should be fine. Sorry, Williams. They got that guy. Book Knight, Gobert. They're running a 10. I'm sorry, but I'm lowering that to a 9. So, sorry, Clark. I mean, honestly, I'll give you minutes over Rudy Gobert. I don't know. Yeah. All right. So let's say we, oh wait, first of all, we gotta look at his stats. I'm all over the place. We gotta look at Mark's stats with the Grizzlies. Okay. 13, 7, 1, 2. 59 and 83. Obviously, the point went down a little bit. Because at one, I think he got less minutes. And two, there's way more players on this team. So he's not gonna get that much opportunity. But. Are they in the playoffs? Nope, they didn't make the playoffs. Alright. Shocking. How did how did Grizzlies make the playoffs? They were in the play in. That's a good that's a really good team. I don't know how they didn't make it. But we got Tatum and the Knicks versus that guy in the Rockets. Rockets win at five. Grinchella Green's your finals MVP. K MVP. Giannis got Depoy. At some point, I'm going to start skipping those. Alright, we got to see where Mark went. Mark. Got to do it like this. Go to setters. Hold on, I did that wrong. There we go. Okay. Mark is still a free agent. So, he ended this year off as a free agent. Dang. Hold on, I want to see some. Um, Mark, okay. Nope, not him. Mark, 27 years old, 81 overall. He's still young, 27? I have a sneaky suspicion this might be an early retirement, though. Only because he's not getting... He's a free agent, like, every year. I don't know. He's good. Like, I don't know why. He's not, like, a superstar or anything, but, like, he puts up good numbers. So I don't know why he doesn't have a contract. So, I was saying he might, he might be on that free agent route, which is insane. It seems like lately, when we do these career sips, a lot of the rookies retire early because they just hit free agency and no team wants them. So, I think it happened with O'Shea. Who else? It happened with, like, one other person, I think. Like, lately it's been happening. I don't know. I hope this doesn't happen for every rookie from here on out, because that'd be kind of, uh... That'd be kind of boring. Thunder versus Knicks. Chet versus Tatum. Thunder sweep. Shazer finals MVP. K got MVP. Jackson got six man. Chet got Depoy. Alright. Pacers on the one seat again. Mark averaged. They traded him. Ah, oh, they traded him. All right. Um, we gotta look for him. Actually, since they did it, I could just go here, go to Pacers, and see what happened. To the Blazers. Okay. Let's go to Portland. The Blazers are the one seed on the West. So he went from one seed East to one seed in the West. The Trailblazers got Nick Smith, Shaded Sharp, Moody, Gadford, Durant, Simons, Mark, Cam, Jabari. That's a really good team. Like, that's a really good team. Okay. Mark in 24 minutes. Okay. Let's see what he averaged. All right, he averaged 13, 6, and 2, 64, 82. He's 30 years old. Let's see what they do. They win in five in the first round. Mark averaged 14, 6, and 1. All right. They got to go against OKC. 
they win in five again. Mark averaging 14-4 and 2. I think this is the furthest he's been in the semifinals. I think this is the furthest he's been, so we'll see what happens. And he's in the finals versus his former team. Booker of the Pacers versus Sharp of the Blazers. Two one seeds in the playoffs. In that third round, he didn't really do much. 8-5-1. and one. 36 for Sharp, though. Oh, my gosh. All right. Here we go. We lose game one. Mark had 14. Lose game two. Mark had nine. Ugh, lose game three. Mark only had four. Win game four. Mark with ten. We win game five. Mark with seventeen. Ah, but we lose at six. Pacers win at six. Booker's your finals MVP. And then in game six, Mark had twenty. So in the finals, he averaged twelve, six, and two. Overall, he averaged 12-5-2. Okay. That's definitely the first he's ever made it. NBA Finals. Going on MVP. Blazers are the eighth seed. A playing tournament team. Mark Williams got treated. Okay. The Clippers. All right, switch over to the Clips. Clippers are the two seed in the playoffs. Okay, we'll see what they got. They got Kyle Lowry Jr. So Kyle Lowry's son. He gets those his, he can shoot three. Really great free throw shooter. Okay. 5'10". Okay. So we got him. We got an old LaMelo ball. Kind of old. He's around the same age as Mark. Laurie LaMelo, Miller, Cox, Garuba. 86 overall. That's the highest. How's he an 8? Wait a minute. How is he at 86 overall? <sighs> How is he at 86 overall? Look at his stats. Those are like a 70 overall. How is he at 86 with those stats? I'm so confused. He plays minutes too. It's not like he doesn't play any minutes. How the hell did he reach 86 overall? He played every season. I'm so confused, but all right. Mark, all right. Pretty, pretty good team. You know, always change to a nine-man, but it's a pretty good team. All right. Let's see what they do in the first round. Gets the Jazz. They win. All right. Let's look at the playoff stats, see what uh Mark did. Alright. Eight, eight, and two. None too crazy. Now they got the Thunder. They're up three one. They won four one to the Thunder. In round two. Mark was seven four, two and two. Now they got Golden State. They're in the finals. Garnett in the Sixers versus Lamelo in the Clippers. Mark is back in the finals for the second time. In that third round, he averaged 10, 10, 7, 3, and 2. Clippers versus Sixers. Sixers win at 5. Jackson's your finals MVP. All right. Mark, 79 overall, 37. All right, he said he's going he's gonna to retire. 
I've accomplished all I can accomplish. It's time to move on. So, let's look at him. 5-3-1-1-53-84. Let's view his career for a second. So, the highest points per game he's had was the 26-27 season with the Bulls, 14. And then Portland, 34-35 season, 13. He never had 15-plus. Good good field goal shooter. You know, field, field goal is such good. Really good free throw shooter for a center. Um, overall stats is 11, 6, 1, 1, 58, 16, 82. Yeah, 82, 24 minutes. In terms of the records, I'm honestly... The only ones I'm going to check, I'm going to save y'all some time. I'm going to check the rebounds. And then the blocks. Those are like the only two things I'm going to check. Honestly. If there's a free throw percentage, I'll probably check that. Because I feel like he could be high on that list too. But he's going to retire. Those are the only ones I'm going to check. No championships. Two finals appearances. That's about it. So. Those are the only things I'm going to check. I'm going to start doing after some of these rookies. I'm going to just check what I think they could be in. Categories they could be in. Because I don't want to waste time to check everything and they're not in it. Knicks versus Mavs again. Edwards versus Dyson. Mavs winning five. Harvey's your finals MVP. So, we know Mark Williams is gone. He was a free agent, so we just got to look for his name. Oh, well, okay. So that's him. Mark Williams, 37 years old, 15 years pro. He retired at a regular, at a normal time for a rookie. Definitely a Hall of Famer. Definitely, I guess Drew's retired. Um, let's get out. Let's get this out the way. Why are they tell me all this, bro? Like, oh my gosh, I gotta go through all of this just to get to the next season. Finally, all right. Well, y'all know we gotta look at NBA history. Okay, NBA records. I need to know that for like next time. So again, I'm only checking. What am I checking? Field goals. Maybe we could check because he had a he had high field goal percentages. We could check that. I'm only checking certain categories that I think he could be in. So, field goals made. He's not in this one. All right. Free throws made. This is the one I said I was going to check. And percentage, if there's a free throw percent. I don't know if there is. Because uh, he was a free throw shooter. And again, y'all can let me know in the comments if I missed his name. Whatever. I'm trying to go quick, but I'm also trying to read it. Rebounds, we'll check this. I'm sorry I'll keep like sniffling stuff throughout the vid. I'm kind of, kind of have a cold a little bit. It's not crazy bad, but it is kind of annoying. So, if you hear all of that, that's, that's the reason why. But I had to record this vid, so we did that. Mark is not in rebounds. Let's check blocks. Um, that's Herb Williams. There he is. I knew he was going to be in one of these. Mark Williams, he's 46 for blocks. Um, field goal percent, is he on here? There he is, 23rd for field goal percent with 58%. Free throw percent, I feel like he should be on here because he was a really good free throw shooter. Sorry off, I hit the mic. Is he really not going to be on here? I thought he was going to be on this one because he was a really good free throw shooter. I guess he didn't have higher than 86 overall. Yeah, because the first few seasons he wasn't that crazy. Rebounds per game, I don't think he's going to be on this list. He 
He's not on this one. Okay. Let's check blocks. There he is. 70 knife in blocks per game. Games played. I don't. Do you play a lot? No, he did miss two seasons, so I don't think he's going to be here either. But let's just check. Nope. I didn't even check his career, his his highs and shit. Sorry, but his highs. I didn't even check it. God dang it. Ah, uh, that's one thing I forgot to check. Well, I don't think he ever had freaking... 40 points, so... Yeah. Alright, but that is it for now, y'all. Mark Williams, curse him. Not really that good. i am be honest with you. Was it the worst? I don't I feel like I say that about every... Not every curse but these few curse I feel like I've been saying that. It might actually be the worst. I feel like it actually might be the worst, but... Hey, at least he wrote out the career until he was 37. At least he didn't retire early. There's that. But he never had a 15. He doesn't have no awards, no nothing. Made it to finals twice. And that's about it. But yeah, y'all. Bye, y'all.